The matter in which the Forest 27 has had a portion allocated to individuals is still a burning issue. While in opposition, the United Party for National Development, UPND, had promised to demolish all structures built. And now, people are wondering why government has taken so long to take action on the Forest 27. But Minister of Water Development and Sanitation, Mike Imposha, says the delay on the matter has been caused by a number of legal battles to ensure all necessary procedures are followed. Mr. Mposha says a number of meetings at both technical and ministerial levels are being held to ensure the water aquifer is and protected. Not that issue to just uh, die and be buried. But I must say that the delay has been caused by obviously a number of legal battles. You know that when someone goes and acquires a title, for you to undo that title, you also have to take the legal route. Right now, uh, you cannot just cancel. The legal provisions will not allow you to just cancel the title. You must go to court and challenge. In, then the court must declare that that particular title must be cancelled. So we are looking at, uh, I don't want to preempt, but uh, I can confirm that we've been having several meetings. Uh, and my ministry is part of the stakeholders of the He says the issue is very active and soon action will be taken on forest number 27. Uh, sorting out this very carefully so that we must restore order there but without necessarily having to uh, inflict financial pain on the part of government. So we don't want to take a move where people will find an opportunity to go to court and then be compensated by again that will be losing a lot of money. So we are doing this very carefully, but I want to confirm that the Forest 27 issue is receiving so much attention. Mr. Mposha has cautioned that those with houses built on Forest Number 27 should be sleeping with one eye because the issue is alive and not dead. Charlotte Sijunda, Damon News in Indola.